Hi guys, Eric here from Elozo. Today we're gonna look at the Vario Cordura single pass watch strap. I've seen Cordura straps appear more and more recently. As a fan of NATO's, I've been curious how they feel and look like. Now I've got the opportunity when Vario sent me a single pass to review. For this review, I'm using the strap with the Vario G-Shock adapter. The single pass is made of Cordura fabric. It's lightweight and comfortable against the skin with improved breathability. Other attributes also include resistance to abrasion, tears, scuffs, water, and stains. There's no denying that since it is what Cordova fabric is known for. There are things to like and dislike about the strap. I'll go through each and every one of them in this review. What to like? The main reason why I like the strap is it does feel like it will accept abuse quite well. Don't doubt a bit that this can be a daily strap beater. The Cordura 1000D is often used in bags, backpacks, military equipment, motorcycle clothing, workwear, and footwear. There's no denial that Vario chose this denier as it's also thicker compared to the 500D. The stitching looks intact and tight, especially on the buckle side. I don't think the thread breaking will be a problem for this strap. Buckles are made in stainless steel and feel solid. No problem on that side as well. Another reason is that the strap just looks good. The rivets add a bit of contrast regardless of the color you choose. This also adds a bit of a tough look to it. Pricing isn't too bad at 32 US dollar with free shipping. Of course, you buy more straps, you get more discount. Another reason why I love the strap is that there are enough holes for most wrist sizes. I tried twisting it to see if any of the rivets will pop up, but so far, none have done so. However, due to the fixed keepers, there will be an excess strap showing, and you can't hide it with the fixed keepers. It tends to get stuck on my jackets that have guarded sleeves, which can get quite annoying. What do I dislike? The strap is quite thick and might have some fitting issues with watches that have short lugs. I had trouble fitting it in my watches with their default spring bars. For example, it wouldn't fit the SKX if you tried to use the fat bars. This works best with the G-Shock adapter that Vario sells or watches that have long lugs such as the Hamilton Khaki Field. Alternatively, curved spring bars will give it a bit more allowance as well. The cotton underlining is not as comfortable as I hoped. If you like your watches with a bit of a wiggle, you will feel the abrasiveness as it slides up and down. This is more evident if you are used to NATO straps that have a seatbelt weave. Who do I recommend this strap for? It's easy to recommend this if you have a G-Shock adapter and have a large wrist. I would also recommend this if you have watches with long lugs. Small wrists need not apply. An alternative if you really want a Cordura strap is to get the two-piece version, which is also available at Vario. Thank you everybody for watching. Like, subscribe, or leave some comments below if you have any feedback or want me to review any other straps.